diagonals of a rectangle are equal and bisect each other. Very good. So let us take this rectangle which is there in the picture and call it as A, B, C and D. Okay. And let's draw the diagonals of this rectangle as well. Okay. Let the point of intersection be called as point M. Okay. Now in a rectangle, what do we know? We know that this side is equal to this side. AD is equal to BC being opposite sides of rectangle. And what we also know is that this angle and this angle and this angle and this angle, all of them are equal to 90 degree. Right? Now, basis whatever is given to us, diagonals of a rectangle are equal. What are the diagonals? The two diagonals in this rectangle are AD. Sorry. AC and BD. So you have to prove AC is equal to BD. Okay? and bisect each other. I'll come back to this bisect each other later on. Now how do you prove that this particular side AC is equal to BD? For that the only way it is possible is that if AC and BD are part of some triangle okay and we can prove that these triangles are congruent. So let us consider triangle ADC ADC and triangle B D C. Okay. Now if you consider these two, <coughs> then the side D C is common to both the triangle D C. Okay. So we can say that D C is equal to D C being a common side. Right. Also, angle ADC, which is this angle ADC, is equal to angle BCD. Or maybe let me do it like this. I'll just draw out these two triangles separately. That might just make it a little bit more easier for you to understand. Right? So DC is equal to DC, this side is equal to this side. ADC angle, angle ADC which is 90 degree is equal to angle BCD. Okay. Why? Because these are both 90 degree. Okay. And AD which is this side. So we took this side, we took this angle and we took this side is equal to BC. Why? This side is equal to this side. Why? Because these are opposite sides of rectangle. Right? So hence by side angle side criterion we have proved that these two triangles are congruent. Right? So this angle this. Now if that be the case corresponding part of the congruent triangles are equal which means that basically AC should be equal to BD. Right? But if you notice AC is equal to BD is what we were supposed to prove because these were the two diagonals. Hence we say that the diagonals of a rectangle are equal. Right? Second part. Diagonals of a rectangle bisect each other. Now what would this mean? This would mean that basically in this particular rectangle AM, let me just remove this part. AM 
will be equal to MC and MD should be equal to BD if this is true okay now how can we prove this to prove this obviously we need to take a triangle which considers both these sides AM and MD AM and MD so obviously I need to consider this part and I need to consider this part right so we will take triangle A M D and triangle B M C now if you see basically angle D A M which is this angle is equal to angle MCB which is this angle why because these are basically alternate angles how come now we know these two lines are parallel okay this is kind of a transversal cutting this two lines if you extend this right so obviously this angle will be equal to this similarly angle a d m will be equal to angle c b m again alternate angles right and in any case AD is equal to BC why because these are basically opposite sides of the rectangle right so basically applying the angle side angle criterion which is this angle side this angle we prove that triangle ADM is congruent to triangle BMC if that be the case then the corresponding sides of the triangle should be equal hence AM should be equal to MC and BM should be equal to MD BM right <coughs> 